it real I'm independent, I don't need no deal I'm Jaws on the beat, I got flow that kills Do my thing with a few G's, Lauren Hill Right, so another super nifty thing that's been added into Logic 10.5 is the simple sampler, something that Logic has definitely needed for a long time and it will now save me lots of effort in doing it in Alchemy instead. Let's check it out. So what the quick sampler does is let us load up basically a single sample and have it instantly available for quick playback. So if we can grab like a single sample that's from a sample pack, just like a one shot, and we can just drag it in. And we've got two options when we go to drag it in. So we've got use the original tuning loudness, etc. We've got optimized. So if there are loop points and things like that in the sample already, so embedded data, it will read that information. Let's drop this in here. So we've loaded it. So it instantly loads up the sample and it's ready to play. But like many things, we've but like many of the new additions, we've got lots of other things to play with. Pretty much everything from the larger sampler has been introduced as well. For example, we can instigate two LFOs that then <clears throat> that can then be linked to different parameters using the mod matrix just here. For example, we've got two LFOs that can be linked to different parameters within the sampler. So just at the bottom here, we can we can have LFO one go to say a target of something like pitch and have it fluctuate by just giving the slider and have it move up by say just four cents. Or wildly move. just adding a little bit of a natural feel to it. Really, really useful thing to be in there. We've also got a mod matrix. We can actually configure many different parameters to other areas. For example, velocity could open and close our filter. So if we introduce our filter, which is essentially the same filter with all the same slopes from the old EXS24. And let's pull that cutoff back. So it's really now muted. If we introduce velocity and set that to the filter cutoff, and we're gonna add it this way. We can see that as I play with a harder velocity, it opens up the filter. And you can now hear very quickly, we've got this one single sample, but we're starting to get a bit of a natural fun instrument out of it. Under each thing here, under each module here, so the pitch, filter, and amplitude, we've got our own ADSR envelopes, or as we can see here, it's just attack and decay on the pitch, for example. Well, we can switch those to AR, ADSR, and AHSDR as well, being an incredibly powerful, simple sampler here. In terms of loop manipulation itself, well, it works a lot like the smart handles when you bring a piece of audio into Logic. We can bring fades in very quickly with just a single drag at the top. We can change the start times just by dragging the sliders at the bottom. If you want to know more about the quick sampler, stay tuned to the channel and I'll be doing a deep dive in how we can make patches and use this in our music.